Alright, what do you think? It's your boy Money here. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, turn on post notifications, and use code Money in the item shop. And with all that being said, guys, let's get into today's video because I have an absolutely insane and very different video here for you guys today. So as most of you may or may not know, I don't usually get into any kind of drama or any kind of beef online. I usually keep that stuff personal and I never ever bring it on the internet. But today is different because I got into a little bit of drama with some famous TikTok girl and I'm gonna expose her completely in this video and this isn't just any famous tiktok girl this is one of the most famous tiktokers in the world as you guys can see on your screen right now she has about almost 14 million followers and that's basically just unheard of like there's not that many people in the world that have that big of a following and if you guys are still a little bit confused as to who this is let me just show you guys a tiktok of hers and maybe it might help you ring a bell roll it Alright, um, that was awkward, but anyways, I know some of you guys may be wondering, Armani, how did you get into a drama with this TikToker? What is this beef about? Well, trust me, guys, I'm about to expose the absolutely crazy side of TikTokers you've never seen before. I promise you guys, these famous TikTokers aren't the type of people you think they are. A lot of them are really stuck up and really full of themselves and think they're way better than everybody else and think they're some sort of celebrity or something. And usually people are way too scared to expose these famous TikTokers because they think they're gonna get a lot of hate. Well, I don't care. I'm I'm gonna expose every single thing in this video and if by the end of this video I don't have you convinced that these famous tiktokers are actually really bad people then I failed so like a wise man once said let's go right into the news all right guys so this all started in my last video where I DM'd 50 famous tiktok girls to play fortnite with me and you know it was all going well I got a lot of responses but one response stuck out in particular and it was from this girl named Sarah who I showed you guys earlier that has 14 million followers on tiktok and after i asked her to play fortnite with me she actually agreed she said oh my god i love your videos i'm down to play fortnite whenever you want just text me here's my phone number so i obviously went about my day and this last night i decided to actually call her and ask her to play fortnite with me just like she said and i called her so many times but she never picked up so i decided to dm her again on tiktok and i said hey um do you still want to play fortnite i know you gave me your phone number and i tried calling you but you weren't picking up so i thought i'd message you on here and to be honest i didn't know if she was gonna reply or not because if she wasn't answering her phone calls then she probably isn't on her phone but she did reply in a couple minutes and she said this does it look like i want to play fortnite with you use your brain i'm not a little kid and i have better things to do so don't waste my time like wow i'm not gonna lie to you guys like when i saw that it actually caught me off guard like earlier she was saying she was down to play fortnite with me and she gave me her phone number and now she's being so mean and so rude saying she doesn't want to play fortnite with me and that she's not a little kid and not to waste her time like this doesn't even sound like the same person so at first i thought it was some sort of a prank and i said to her what what do you mean when i randomly dm'd you and asked if you want to play fortnite with me you said you're a fan of my videos and you even gave me your phone number so we could play and that's just 100 percent truth guys i mean to be honest with you guys it doesn't really matter to me if she wants to play fortnite or not like i don't care about that the only reason i even wanted to play with her is because a lot of you guys in my comments picked her and i just wanted to make a video about it other than that it doesn't even matter to me the thing i'm more concerned about is why is she being so rude to me i thought she was actually a very nice girl but it gets even worse because she responds saying i've watched your videos in the past and i knew what you were doing i knew you were making some sort of video so that's why i acted like i wanted to play fortnite with you don't you have a brain okay first of all what is this girl talking about she just admitted to me she just admitted that she lied when i texted her in my last video asking her to play fortnite with me like who does that and on top of that i don't know why she's calling me names and stuff because i'm literally just talking to her like a normal person and i'm actually being pretty nice if you ask me so at this point i was actually kind of getting a little bit fed up and i decided to confront her and i just say i'm sorry i don't know why you're being mean i was just asking because you literally said call me and we'll play tonight those were your words not mine once again just reiterating the truth like i'm trying to see this for what it is but then what she said next completely blew my mind and this is a part that i cannot believe she replies to me saying i have 14 million followers on tiktok do you really think i have time to play a stupid cartoon game with some youtuber i knew you were making a video so i used you got my clout and left it's as simple as that hun like what are you guys seeing this right now she just admitted to using me and clout chasing and she knew that i was making a video so she tried to get some sort of fame or some sort of reward out of it like which i don't understand like she has 14 million followers on tiktok how much more clout does she want and the fact that she's even bragging about it is just messed
messed up. So I say to her, so you're basically just admitting to me that you were cloud chasing and that you used me because you knew my video would get views? What's wrong with you? I actually thought you were a nice person and I was planning to make another video with you because you said you wanted to play Fortnite with me. And you guys will not believe what happened next. After I mentioned once again that I was going to make another video with her, she completely did a 180 and switched up and started acting like a nice person again. Just take a look at this. She says you wanted to make another video with me. Okay, well in that case, I'm down to play Fortnite with you as long as you link my TikTok and Instagram in your bio and I charge $350 an hour. You can send it to my PayPal, hun. And then she sent me her email. Like, not only does she want her TikTok and Instagram linked in my bio on my YouTube video, but on top of that, she says she charges $350 an hour just to make a video with her. Is she absolutely insane? I mean, who in the right mind would pay her $350 an hour? She's acting like she's some sort of famous movie star or something. That she's worth that much money. Like, I understand she has a lot of followers on TikTok, but not that many people know her on YouTube. I bet you guys didn't even know her before I made this video on her. But anyways, then her response was saying, are you crazy? Oh, so now you want to be nice to me because I said I'll make a video with you and you want me to pay you $350 an hour? You've lost your mind. You're a cloud chaser, LOL. And to tell you guys the truth, like I've heard so many stories about cloud chasers on TikTok. I mean, literally almost every famous TikToker is a cloud chaser in some way or another, but never have I seen anything this crazy. I mean, just take a look at what she says next. She responds to me saying, how am I a cloud chaser? There's a reason I have almost 14 million followers on TikTok. People love me. I'm a celebrity and you're a nobody. If a nobody wants to make a video with a celebrity, they have to pay. Do you understand that or do you need to get your mom? Like what? At this point, she's literally acting like I'm not even a real person. She's calling me a nobody and now she's way more famous than me. Like, I don't really care if she has so many followers on TikTok. I mean, at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter, does it? And suddenly she's turned into some sort of comedian. I mean, she's trying to roast me and I don't know if that makes her feel better about herself or what the deal is but it's just not cool so i just be 100 percent honest with it i just say you're a horrible person i think getting all those followers really grew your ego just because you have more followers or more people know you doesn't mean you're better than me or that you're a celebrity and i mean obviously i knew famous tiktokers had huge egos because that's just how they're built up to be but i never knew somebody could be this egotistical like her ego is literally through the roof she's literally acting like she's the president of the united states or something at this point i mean she replies saying excuse me do you even know who you're talking to people stop me on the street to take photos of me and pay hundreds of dollars to even be in the same room as me we are not on the same level remember that at this point she's literally just trying to rub it and trying to prove that she's more famous than me that everybody in the world knows her that they stop her on the street to take photos like who cares i mean all i'm getting from this is that she's really insecure and that all she cares about is followers and money so i say to her your parents definitely didn't raise you right just because you have followers doesn't mean you're more important than others and you're definitely not a celebrity and for some reason she thinks she has to prove to me that she's some sort of famous celebrity because she replies with this tiktok and says oh i'm not a celebrity yet this video has 10 million views 2.4 million likes and 7,000 comments like i said pay me 350 per hour and we can make a video at this point she's just trying to brag about her numbers i mean before i say anything just watch this tiktok because i have no words roll it for a player you don't know that many major chords we hang out Okay, if that's not the cringiest thing I've ever seen, then I don't know what is. Like, that's literally what she does. And she's trying to call herself some famous celebrity who literally everybody in the world knows. Like, that's her job. Like, that's what she does. She All she did was flip her hair for five seconds. And she's trying to make me feel like I'm a nobody. And at this point, I'm just getting annoyed because it's gotten way out of hand. So I say to her, you don't deserve your platform. Someone like you should be a role model and help other creators out. Yeah, you're out here trying to scam me and make me pay to talk to you. You need your head screwed on a little tighter. And then she replies to me saying babe i don't think you understand i have more money in my bank account than you can ever imagine i can buy you your family and your house 10 times over so stop wasting my time boo i mean at this point she just shown that her true colors and the type of person she really is instead of the type of person she shows she is on tiktok and i mean if she has so much money in her bank account then why is she trying to get me to pay her per hour so i reply saying all you do is brag about how many followers or how much money you have yet you're still trying to cloud chase and want me to put you in a video so you can get even 
even more clout. Otherwise, why else would you still be talking to me? You need help. And she responds to me saying, don't tell me how to live my life. I can do whatever I want, whenever I want, and you can't do anything about it. Pay me my money so I can get clout off your YouTube channel. We won't speak ever again, okay? At what point does this stop? Like, she's already got 14 million followers. How many more followers does she want? I understand she's not no Charlie D'Amelio, but I mean, that's a lot of followers. You don't need any more clout. So I reply saying, okay, at this point, you're just getting annoying. I'm not paying you anything. Have fun with your cringy TikToks. I'm just gonna go find someone else. And I basically just try to end the conversation right there because i just didn't want to talk to her anymore but she was so desperate for even more clout that she decided to respond to me and said did you just call my tiktoks cringy you're just mad you'll never get a million followers or likes or anything i work hard for my tiktoks don't ever disrespect me like that ever again or I'll ruin your life hon wait wait let me just get this straight did she just say that she works hard for her tiktoks i mean all she does is stand there for 10 seconds and do some sort of dance if that's what she called working hard then i don't even know what to say at this point and i'm about to prove her completely wrong because i reply with this tiktok and i say is this what you call working hard for your tiktok it's literally 15 second clip of you falling and walking oh my god you're so talented you can walk in a straight line and i mean guys just watch this tiktok for yourself and tell me whether or not you think this takes a lot of hard work or not roll it anime is an important part of our culture no, 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 no. Oh, look at him Yup guys, look at all that hard work. I mean, she must be sweating after that. Who is she kidding? Is that what she calls hard work? I've seen my dog do that on his way to get his first meal in the morning. But I'm not gonna lie to you guys, she actually got really mad about that because she replied saying, Oh, so you wanna make jokes about my TikToks now? You just started something that you aren't gonna be able to finish. You're messing with the wrong girl, hun. Say goodbye to your YouTube channel. Like, what does she mean by that? Say goodbye to my YouTube channel. What in the world can she possibly do? I mean, all I can think of is that she's gonna send her, her fans to drop some dislikes and mean comments on my videos. But I mean, that doesn't really matter to me. I don't really care. Otherwise, I wouldn't even be making this video in the first place. So then I said to her, I'm sorry, but are you threatening me? What are you gonna do? Dance in front of me for 15 seconds and hope something happens? Stick to TikTok. I'm not scared of you. I told you guys if I wanted to roast her, I could have roasted her this whole time. But I'm trying to be nice and I'm trying to be the bigger person here. Because all she's been talking about is how much money she has and how much clout she has. Yet she's the one acting like a child. And I mean, she completely freaked out. She replies to me saying, you don't have to be scared of me. That's not my point. Good thing I know a lot of hackers that can hack your channel in less than a day and have you delete it like it's nobody's business no one will even remember who you are it's okay you can always come to tiktok and try to get famous like me but you'll never be as big remember that boo okay is it just me or is the way that she texts just super cringy and i mean it's so obvious that this girl is so insecure because she's been mean to me this whole time she's been completely roasting me but as soon as i try to say something bad to her she completely flips out and starts threatening me saying that she's gonna get my channel hacked or deleted or whatever i mean we'll see about that so our passing you literally just threatened to hack my channel and, and get it deleted because i don't want to pay you to be in my video you do know that's illegal right you can't can't just get people to hack me like that i have all the messages and i'm gonna expose you have fun like, i mean how dumb can you be she literally threatened me saying all those things but i have all the messages and i have all the proof in front of me so i mean she could do whatever she wants but she will get exposed and that's why i'm making this video on her right now but for some reason she doesn't care because she says expose me weird in front of your 250,000 youtube subscribers i have 14 million followers who do you think they're gonna believe me or you you mess with the wrong girl and you're gonna regret this and i mean she's not wrong i only have 250,000 subscribers and she has 14 million followers but guess what i have the proof and i'm the one telling the truth so i say maybe they won't believe me but at least i'm telling the truth and people will realize that you're just a lying cloud chasing tiktoker bye and i mean you guys can decide for yourself who you want to believe in this situation i'm telling you guys i'm telling the truth and i have all the proof in front of me right here i mean leave a comment down below on whose side you're actually really on if you're on my side thank you very much for supporting me but wait there's more because i feel like we should prove her wrong this whole time she's been bragging about how many followers she has or how many likes she gets on her tiktoks and how my fan base is weak and i'm nothing compared to her then it's time to prove her wrong so if you're a fan of mine and you watch all my videos let's show her how 
strong the Armani army actually is. So please go follow me on TikTok or Instagram or whatever it may be. My TikToks are on the screen right now and my Instagram and Twitter are in the description. If you don't have an account, do whatever you have to do. Make a new account, get your mom's phone and make a new account and follow me. And let's show her how strong we really are because this isn't just between me and her anymore. This is much bigger than that. She just started a war between YouTube and TikTok and I have a feeling we're way stronger than them. So go follow me and let's prove her wrong. And if you made it to the end of this video, love you so much. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, turn on post notifications. And it's been your boy Armani. I'm out. Peace.